Welcome back, everybody. Here we are at the PAX East Twitch stage. And we're here with Bob and John. Uh, Don Fubar, of course. I got but we're you. here with Bob and John from Humble Bundle. How are you guys doing? doing Good. What? Excellent. We got lots of games to cover. We don't have a lot of time to waste. We're going to see uh, four games today. The first game you saw is called A Hat in Time. That was a little trailer that we saw. That's correct. And we're going to go right to the game right now so we don't waste any time. Like... Tell me, yeah. uh, while we're playing, tell me about the game. Yeah, so this is a hat in time. It's by Gears for Breakfast. Um, and for this particular demo, the developers hooked us up with a bunch of different hats. And you could tell maybe from the title that there's going to be hats involved in this game, right? Sure, sure, um, sure. So for this one, we'll start off with the kid's hat. We're exploring a place called Mafia Town. You might get the sense it's a... Sounds safe. Yeah, it's a little shady. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we're going to walk around and explore a bit. So there's interesting characters in Mafia Town. This one, for instance, is Mustache Girl. We're not sure if she's a... <laughs> mustache girl? Yeah. <laughs> I think that was my lunch lady. <laughs> we don't, yeah, it, it could be. We don't know for sure what her alignment is, so we're going to chase after her and, and find out. I'm guessing, like, the different hats have different powers and stuff. Exactly yeah. right, yes. Right on, okay. So uh, in, in this instance, Mustache Girl can get away from us, and uh, she's pretty quick. So uh, John's using his ability right here after he gets tripped by this, uh, by this gentleman back there uh, called the Kid's Hat. So this shows us, like where the next objective is in the game. Oh, okay. So this is the first hat you're going to start off with. So we can keep chasing after her, or we can just run around in the classic, like, 3D platformer vibe, right? Yep, yep. Um, so in a hat in time, you're going to collect different pieces of cloth, and you're going to use those pieces of cloth to build out different hats, like you said. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, so you, can, you actually, like, construct hats. Right, right. Okay. correct. Okay. And so the game evolves by you getting those new hats and being able to access new areas in the maps. Sure, 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 sure. Um, so one we can show off is the Dweller Mask. And again, you're going to have to build this, but we get, we get it off the bat just to play with. Um, so the Dweller Mask allows you to access different areas in the game. Here's a piece of cloth that builds a floating hat. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, and then uh, now you can build up your floating hat, and then you'll be able to theoretically float. So that offers well, a little yeah, bit of the I mean, replayability within the game. Exactly right. Out your yeah. The, that's, the that's floating cool hat me. helps you float, and of course, this Fox Mask allows you to see green blocks. Yes. Makes just, sense. Uh, most foxes can <laughs> see green blocks. We can check out a new hat, too. It's a little-known nature fact. <laughs> yeah. Science. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> On the stream Science. today. <laughs> uh, so the ice hat. Yeah, let's look at the ice hat. So the ice hat's cool. You get, like, a ground and pound AOE effect technique. You can oh, also okay, okay. And see, here's some discoverability. Again, you can find this uh, icy diving board here. And uh, you can traverse great distances that you wouldn't have gone to before. Absolutely. So for so this demo, we just get you, that. You would have to do, now you can't like do the floating hat, you have to do the ice hat. Correct. Okay. Yeah. Could you do like combos? Like could you do the ice bounce into the floating hat and then float off into some other? Oh man, that's a very good question that we're not necessarily prepared that's to answer. Oh, that's fine. Ooh. <laughs> you stumped I, us. That's why I'm here. I asked the hard hitting question. Can you not do the gotcha question, please? <laughs> um, Softballs only. <laughs> so, uh, so you can do some other stuff. In a hat in time, obviously, uh, with or without hats. Uh, so uh, Hat Kid here has a superhero cape. Nice. Can float around. Okay. She can access uh, some areas without hats. She can also attack with the cape. Um, and there's just more items to explore. So these shiny boxes here, for example, Sean can go check out. They don't really respond to umbrellas. We're going to just jump ahead and show you what the brewing hat can do, which is... Uh, make beer. Make beer and... Oh. Explode stuff. Oh, you're yeah. like you're an alchemist. Yeah. Oh, okay, exactly gotcha. right. That sounds better than a kid making beer. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe where you're from. <laughs> uh, so you, yeah. So there's just fun stuff to do in this game, and that's really it's like the uh, old school 3D platformer, old school, old yeah. school for us. Um, yeah, like uh, I keep I think old school, and I'm old school. You yeah. know? I, I remember like obviously this harkens back to like Mario 64. 
and that kind of stuff. Very, very cool platformy, different, malleable power ups and mm. that, that kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. Okay. We got to move on to the next yeah. game. Let's do it. All right. So we got a trailer for this one. Mm -hmm. Let's check it out. <laughs> 